Do we have anyone who is aging out this season? Please come into the middle of the circle. Age out. Normally at this point we'd be like in an end zone, we'd do some basics and they would do some basics and then we would be and they would be crying and all this kind of stuff. But it's raining outside and we're in The important thing is, is that basketball? No. The important thing is you guys realize that everyone around you is what you leave behind. Everybody in the outside of the circle go to attention please. Take a look around. Okay, when you guys get old, oh, you're already old. <laughs> you come back and look at all these people. It's kind of hard in life to find somewhere to lean the place. Pretty certain every one of these people has learned something from you. If you had five seconds to say anything to this drum corps, five seconds, short, sweet, to say something to the people that are going to carry on after you, wear the same uniforms you wore spin the same flags, play the same drums. You had five seconds. Mind if we start with you? Now is your time. Have fun, good luck. Enjoy every minute. It'll be gone before you know it. Bye, keep it up. Don't take anything for granted, nothing's guaranteed. Be a badass. <laughs> Don't give up, even when you go home. It's the hardest thing I've ever done, but it's the most uh, worthwhile thing I've ever done, so. Don't ever take anything for granted. When I came here in 2008, this is a little bit longer, <laughs> five seconds, but I gotta say it. First five or six days, Crying like a baby, wanting to go home constantly. And now, here I am, <laughs> crying like a baby again. But <laughs> realizing that I am home. And it's, it's really hard to leave this. This is the most amazing thing that I've ever done. And I want you guys to make sure that you live every moment of it. <coughs> every one of you means something to me in some way or another. Every single person in this room. The person that has meant the most to me throughout my drum corps career has been Jessica Knuckleby, who I have shared almost three wonderful years with. In sixth grade, I had a giant crush on her, <laughs> which grew until we finally started dating about three years ago, and I don't even know why it took that long. And uh, I don't want to go on living life without you. <laughs> I love you so much. And uh, I want to keep on loving you for the rest of my life. Will you marry me, Jessica
before you leave. Um, see, I kind of lost my train of thought here. <laughs> Congratulations, you two. Really. I'm a little hurt that you didn't ask me. <laughs>